Are you in a funk? Are you an entrepreneur who's kind of in a funk because things aren't going the way you wanted or you're not making the money or the clients aren't coming or you just can't like get yourself motivated to do the things you know you need to do to get the clients and run the business successfully and productively? Um, if this is you right now, I'm going to propose a mindset shift. And the mindset shift I'm proposing is to get out of your funk by getting pissed off. You got to get pissed off to get motivated, pissed off that you're not making the money right now, that you're not attracting the clients, that you're not seeing the results you wanted. Get pissed off that it's not working because when you're pissed off, I don't want you to project like you'll be angry with people. <laughs> That's not the thing I'm talking about. I want you to get fired up to go get motivated. Because if you just go, woe is me, it's not working, wah, 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 cry, 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 no offense, we could do that for like five, 10 minutes, maybe a day at the very most, but please don't eat your feelings, right? When you eat your feelings and you gain weight and you feel even worse. So stop it, stop doing that. Stop self-sabotaging your success and yourself. You have to take charge of what it is you want and go get it. I know life doesn't always run the way you want. I get it. I've been in so many situations where money was like, ah, scarcity. And I was constantly worried if something was going to come in so I could pay the bills. I've been there many times over the last 20 years. I'm telling you, uh, when you get pissed off that you know you're the best things in sliced bread, you know you've got the goods, you know you've got great programs and offerings, you know you've got some great pricing and people just need to know more about you. Then you're going to talk to more people. You're going to show up at networking events. You're going to put hair and makeup on and do a video like this. I don't care what you look like. Nobody cares what you look like except you. And you're holding yourself back and you are just making excuses. You can make excuses and continue staying in your comfort zone or push through that comfort zone and get to the other side where you're going to see more success and more clients and more money. So what's it going to be? You're going to stay well as me? Or are you going to get pissed off that you can go make some more money and you need to do the things it takes to do that? I'm Katrina Sawa, in case I forgot to mention, uh, with jumpstartyourbiznow.com. And I've seen it all, all kinds of different entrepreneurs. And we get in these funks and... Sometimes we stay in them way too long and we want people around us who coddle us and enable us when what you really need is some tough love. And that's what I'm all about, tough love. But I do, I do it with love. I want you to be successful faster. You want more success faster? Then you got to get off your couch and you got to stop eating the bonbons and you got to get on your computer or you got to get on the phone or you got to send an email or you got to be raw and real in a post you got to do shit. You got to do the right things to get in front of more people so you can, and, and you have to look the part. Please don't come on here in your sweats and ponytail and go, woe is me, woe is me, woe is me, no makeup. Um, life sucks so bad. Stop. Stop that. You have to look like the professional expert so we can trust you to give you our credit card. If you look the part, you can, I don't care what size you are, okay? I just lost a bunch of weight. But before that, I was feeling kind of crappy about my body too, all right? Hey, I've been there. I think most women have been, even the skinny ones. For some reason, they feel really fat. I don't know what's up with that, okay? But regardless, you have to put the smile on. You have to do your best with the clothes and the things you're able to do. I was wearing really baggy shirts and stuff like that for a few years. And finally this year I said, I'm tired of these baggy clothes. I want to get the boob shirts back. <laughs> right. And we have to get our, for me, it was get my sexy back. That's all right. It was getting my sexy back, but I would always still show up as the expert on Zoom, on a call, on a networking event, in person or on Zoom. You have to look the part everywhere you go, everywhere you go. So please take good care of yourself. Take good care of your body. Make yourself look like the expert, whether you feel like it or not, because you're projecting, what you're projecting is the image that you 
want people to see. If you're projecting, woe is me, we're not hiring you. We're not buying your stuff. Okay, so snap out of it or go get some professional help to snap out of it. There's hypnotherapists. There's people who do um, healing with your subconscious blocks. You've got to get some help with this. If it's not an easy enough for you to get pissed off or snap out of it. If that's, that doesn't come easy, you're going to need to do some deeper work on it. It is what it is, right? And you're going to need to invest in that. I've got referrals. If you need some uh, help in that arena, just private message me and I'll give you a couple people that you might be able to talk to. I'm not the one that does that. I, you know, I'm, like I said, I'm kind of a tough love, but I'm a practical tactical. This is what you need to do. This is how you need to look. This is what you need to say type of person to get more clients and make more money and get in front of a lot more people because you're just not talking to enough people in the right way and projecting the, the professional image that you need to project for your ideal clients. So I hope this was the kick in the butt you needed today. Um, if you want more kicks in the butt with love, come and see me. Um, love to talk with you, honestly. Um, it's up to you. Life is a decision. Your business is a decision. If you're making the wrong decisions, you're going to see the wrong results. So make a decision to really go after what you want this year, right now. Why wait? All right. Katrina Salva signing off. Have a good day, everyone.